Hi friends, I am Ayurya Sahibankar. So today's topic is Resurrection Remix 7.0 by Spy on MI11 Review. So let's see the about phone. As you can see, I have installed the Resurrection Remix. The Android version is 9.0. Resurrection Remix version is 7.0. The Android security patch is of 5th January and vendor security patch is of 5 December. I have installed a custom kernel at extreme kernel version 13. In about phone. These are the repeated options. As you can see, buttons, system profile, status bar, gestures. In gestures, you get option like swipe finger for notification, jump to camera and prevent ringing. Rest all are repeated. So let's see the customizations in display settings. You get options like style. In style, you can choose the style that is light, dark, ascent color, dark mode or default, and automatic. Then you can select double tap to wake, double tap to sleep, and font. You get limited options of font. That's it. The main customizations are in resurrection tools. Here you get tons of customizations. See. So let's see status bar. In status bar, you get option like clock, clock position, etc. Show net activity, battery style. In battery style, you get battery style, recircle, portrait, etc. Battery percentage and battery bar. Then status bar weather, then brand logo, notification ticker, system icons, career label, status bar gestures, and status bar items. And in quick setting, you get option like animation, that is animation style, flip or rotate. Animation duration and animation interpreter. An entire layout and a quick pull down. An advanced setting get option like vibrate on touch. Then in recents, you get option of slim recent and hide apps in recent. And lock screen, you get option like power menu on lock screen, fingerprint unlock after reboot, charging info, face auto unlock. Media cover art, then font size on lock screen, font style, and date style and date size, and lock screen weather. And animation, you get option like screen of animation, list view animation, list view interpolator, then scrolling catching, then toast icon, and resurrection remix a configuration tab. That is this, this is animation, the system animation. In miscellaneous, you get option like show CPU info, weather, wave lock blocker, and alarm blocker. In interface, you get option like head up notification, dashboard, system UI tuner, display size. See. It doesn't work. Then custom LCD panel, volume panel, smart pixels. There are many options in font. Many options here are repeated. Then pie, gesture anywhere, screenshot option, and miscellaneous. And navigation, you get the option of navigation bar. Navigation, you can enable fleeing stock or smart bar. Then gestures. Then buttons, you can choose hardware keys. You can choose action for these hardware keys. Then volume rocker options, power menu options, etc. Battery life of this room is pretty good. 
I got around 5 or 6 hours of screen on time. Let's see the NT2 benchmark. With the stock kernel, I got around 8 to or something. Then I installed extreme kernel and the score was 94612. But in C Android setting, C Android ROM, the score is very high. It is around 13548. But as numbers don't matter. There is only one issue in this room that is screen flickering. Every 4.9 kernel based room has same issue. So that's it for this video. If you like the video, smash the like button and subscribe for more awesome videos like this. So we'll be in the next video. Thank you.